We're gonna give the Gorgon a blast on the new freestyle track. So let's go. So if you guys saw last video um, with the uh, Red Cat, I made it brushless and I used uh, stuff on my screen. I used a two cell light bow. It's actually the same one in this truck, but it didn't last too long. So if you guys wanna know what happened, uh, go over and check that out. So we're actually running the same battery in here. We didn't use much of it, so. I have a NIM battery actually on the charger uh, if we do run out. So here's a little track if you guys haven't seen the build of this. I highly recommend you go check it out. Already freaking biffed it. Come on. I feel like this truck will be way better on this than the trail truck was. I can tell you that right now just needs to be four-wheel drive it's not they need to come out with a four-wheel drive gorgon nice little sky wheelie oh yeah definitely need to work on these ramps when the weather gets warmer weather is so horrible that everything is just mud this time of year so it's hard to make jumps. Nice. Oh, nice. Good air. Big air, nice. See, what can we do on this side there? I kind of missed that. Oh, it's just mud right there. Slowed down a lot. Nice. Oh, came off of it a little sideways. Scooped out a lot of dirt off of that. Ouch. Gorgon, the brush motor in here is really loving the mud. Oh, nice. <laughs> Still is able to recover it, even though it's uh, only two wheel drive. Nice little jump there. Yeah, this thing's getting covered in mud. Look at that. That's awesome. Nice, big air. Little side hit there. Oh, yeah, definitely needs four wheel drive. But this pad, I think, is my favorite been there the longest it's really able to get the dirt packed down on that one right there ah tool drive is actually more difficult you see I don't think people really understand that 
Oh, it's tool drive. It must be for beginners. Uh, yeah, actually, tool drive is more for the uh, experienced people. Yeah, tool drive is way more simple, but it's definitely not more simple to drive. <laughs> tool drive is way more difficult to drive than four-wheel drive. I get it. The uh, tool drive does make the cost a lot cheaper. Um, but I think they could have gone the extra road and just made this four-wheel drive because two-wheel drive master truck just doesn't make sense. This thing would be literally the best thing ever if it was four-wheel drive. We don't even need a brushless version. We just need a four-wheel drive version. And Arma tends to listen to their... Uh, listens to their customers a lot so you know they probably will but you know you never know you never know what armor's working on <laughs> they're always working on something uh, all right we'll get we'll wait for one more rollover and then we'll call it quits because i know y'all are probably getting pretty bored got a nice sunset over there and it's winter sunset All right, well, well, there you go. There you have it. I don't want to go too long because y'all will get bored. Well, guys, that was a great bash with the Gorgon. Very muddy back here, but it really loves this track. I definitely need some work, but, you know, it's pretty good as of right now. In the summertime, when everything dries up, I'll, uh, of course, uh, fix it up a little bit. But this pad, I don't think I'll touch because this pad right here is really good very packed down just the other ones it was so muddy that those days that yeah it was kind of impossible but uh yep yeah, whatever but if you guys enjoyed that video give it a big thumbs up subscribe if you have not already and i'll see you guys all in the next episode peace out